This is my brand new 2015 Dodge Challenger Scat Pack, except for the fact that it's no longer brand new. And let me show you why. I got hit in this car. I tell you through the current G-forces, that's just something I don't care about. Let's get the classic rear view or side view mirror shot. I'm gonna give you a Challenger accident update. So my car got in an accident, but now it's fixed. I don't really trust this lift 100%, so might as well put this up with a super heavy car. How do you miss this thing? Like, how do you not see this car, right? Got excited. In this Burnout Extra, I'm going to walk you through the steps on how to drive a manual car. Detail with details, examples, visuals. I was gonna say, good luck with that shit. Holy cow. And then actually gives you a top speed that you've ever hit in the car, which that's wrong. Can't turn it much with one hand. I'll take two hands, get maybe a 16th of a turn, roughly, maybe a 32nd of a turn, and that's good. You really don't need to over tighten these. That's when you start to either strip the inside or it's really just too tight for the filter. Piece of crap. Sky on that went by. What are you doing? Burnouts are cool, so that's why we do them, and we will never not do them. There's no way. What? It's the Challenger. Oh, shit. So that you don't damage the cap as hard. However, it still allows you to loosen it up. Just like that. You can hear a crack come loose. I need to shovel the snow because it's winter, and we have too much snow, and the Challenger, this is uh, not Challenger height. Exactly. Wait, this just in. Uh, the button actually says join. It says join down below, not join now. So join. Regardless of what it is, I need, I need all the help I can get to fix this car. That was sick. It did not look cool at all from in here. I did hear that, yeah. The things we do for burnout. <laughs>